Hello, friend. Okay, so, um, you can't tell, but underneath this band-aid, I, um, pierced myself with a stapler. <laughs> oh, look who wants to come say hi. Domino the cat wants to... Amino is the cutest, isn't she? So why are you looking at me funny? You fool! What's wrong with you? She probably wants to, yeah. Oh no, she wants to sit on my lap. That's convenient. Okay. So I'm going to tell you how all this happened to me. So I was, um stapling something for my economics class and lunch and I hang out in my English teacher from last year's room still at lunch because I don't like the heat and I don't like being outside when it's hot and I also I don't I don't want to get sunburned so. I took the, the the stapler thing and here I I want to move I'm all breathless because I just walked home. There. So now that the top of my head is cut off. There we go. Oh, that's better. So I was, um, walking home. No, I wasn't. What was I doing? Oh, so I was stapling something and, ooh, it's magnetized. And I, like, opened the stapler like that because this thing wasn't stapling. So then I did that and I, like, cut it but I did it was bigger and somehow and I wasn't watching what I was doing so I stapled like it literally like it was this part of my thumb the long part went through here and then the prong went and it came out the other side and I was like at first it didn't hurt I was like hmm this is cool it doesn't hurt and then when I took it out and it started bleeding it hurt a little bit but I didn't cry and then this because you know Big girls don't cry. And then this is, uh, I, fr I broke a nail approximately two minutes after this happened. And then I br dinged my elbow on the sink in the bathroom when I went to go um, try and mop up the blood. So, so that was my day. How was yours? No, other than that, I had a pretty good day. I think. Yeah, I did. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And it's, okay, it's January 21st, and do you know how hot it is where I, it's 74 degrees. What? I don't, I don't like it. I don't like it at all. It, it, as a matter of fact, it really bothers me, because you know why? Because I told you all before, I hate heat. I'm so ineloquent today. Oh, my gosh. that look better? I think so. And I got my first acceptance letter. It was only from Cal State Fullerton, so it's not such a big deal. I don't know if I'll go there or not. But at least I know I got accepted somewhere, right kids? What else? Ooh, I want to see something cool. This is my grandfather. He these to me. They belong to his wife, not my grandmother. He got remarried. See, they are these really neat old opera glasses. Look at these things. And they say Lumiere F.I. Paris. Maybe they're made by the Lumiere brothers, the people who invented film. See, it's backwards, but that little bit there says Paris. Now that's kind of cool. I don't know why I have them here, because I'm never going to go to the opera, probably. I would love to go to the opera. I like Italian and French opera best. I don't really like the German so much. At least the German that I've This is like my most worn outfit right now. I'm wearing, I'm wearing this Hollister cardigan. It looks like it's inside out because it's just how it's made. And then this plain old shirt. It's just one I bought from Forever 21. And then skinny jeans from Urban Outfitters, you know, the BDG people. One of the things I've noticed in BDG is that you really have to, if you are 
Um, I think my waist, I am 26, I think. But you have to order, so I have to order 24 because they stretch out. Especially these ones are 4% spent four percent spandex so I really have to order is it up or down I would say down because it's smaller numerically so that makes sense to me because I don't know why you would I guess in a list vertically you would order side down may make it mean a bigger size but to me numerically it makes more sense to order a size down on like a number line I think horizontally, so you're moving this way. Well, to you, it would be that way, I think. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I bought some new mascara, and I don't like it. You want to know why? Because it's lengthening, but I hate the way it smells, and it's not very volum vol volumizing. Isn't. And that really annoys me, because I like to have a little bit of volume. I don't like clumpy, but this is just... They aren't as in-your-face as I would like, so... My skin's going through a good phase, though, right now. It's very smooth. Oh, I'm obsessed with Marcel the Shell. I love that video. I wish I could imitate him or her or whoever. I think it's a her. It was voiced by her by a girl, so I don't you know why not, but mm, I don't know, you may disagree with me. I'm wearing blush today, but you can't tell because it washes me out, maybe, ah, can you see now? Not really, but I'm liking wearing blush a lot, because when you don't wear anything on your eyes, I feel like your face needs a little bit, a little, you know, a little something, something to keep it interesting. Ugh, my hair is not very voluminous today. Unless I do that. Then that looks kind of messy. I just, I, you know, I don't know. I'm really loving curling my hair because I just think it's much prettier than my hair straight. It's like we all want the opposite of what our hair is, you know what I mean? People with curly hair want it straight and I'm like, oh my gosh, why? Why would you trade such wonderful, full body and just wonderfulness for straight and limp and lean and boring? And I guess people who want straight hair look at people with straight hair and like, why would you trade that all that sleek and that shine and that order for something wild and crazy? And I'm like, because I want it to look good. And I don't like straight hair on me. I never have. I don't think I ever will. And as Taylor Swift says, I will never again straighten my hair to impress a boy. Ever. I'll only straighten my hair if I want to. Which I probably won't, so I probably will not do that. But yeah, all that being said, now my hair looks full, doesn't it? I have a lot of other videos filmed, but not many of them are uh, edited, so, yeah. I'm going to edit this one and then post it, and I thank you for watching, and if you like me, you should subscribe to me, okay? Okay, thanks. Bye-bye. <laughs>